Hey, it's Isabel from thedietsolutionprogram.com and today I want to talk to you about another toxic food ingredient that may be hindering your weight loss efforts and even worse, affecting your health. And that's partially hydrogenated oil, also known as trans fats. So a lot of people don't know what partially hydrogenated oil is. Well basically, chemists and food companies take oil and they take it through a chemical processing and now that oil becomes more shelf stable. So they take those partially hydrogenated oils and fats and they put them into food products so that their food products can last much longer on the shelf. Of course they save money that way, but what happens is it's detrimental to your health. It's actually one of the leading reasons that a lot of people are overweight and a lot of people are dying from heart disease. So it's going to be very important that you look for partially hydrogenated oil in the food ingredients of the foods you choose to eat. So let me show you just a couple of foods that I found at my local store that all had partially hydrogenated oils. And honestly, the list was endless. I could have come home with a complete full shopping cart of foods that had partially hydrogenated oil in it. Coffee mate. People put this in their coffee every single morning and it has tons of vegetable oil, partially hydrogenated coconut or palm kernel oil. It's actually the second ingredient in this product. So if you're using this coffee mate in the morning, stay away from it. You're better off using natural half and half, natural milk. At least those items are natural and don't have toxic chemicals in them. Peter Pan peanut butter. So the ingredients list reads roasted peanuts, sugar, hydrogenated vegetable oils. So if you're using this type of peanut butter, you want to switch to a natural peanut butter. Much, much better and it won't have partially hydrogenated oil in it. These little snack packs. I got the puddings, but there are tons of different ones and they all had partially hydrogenated oil in them. Now, I picked two things that people would normally think are healthy, like these Special K cereal bars, partially hydrogenated oil. And this healthy choice meal, there's nothing healthy about it. It actually has a long list of toxic chemicals in it, so long that I don't even have the time to read all of them to you. And one of them is partially hydrogenated oil. So not only do you want to read the nutrition label, you want to read the ingredients and make sure you're not putting this toxic food additive in your body. For more information on how to put together your own healthy meal plans, visit thedietsolutionprogram.com.